you know, when we were doing the grinder thing, like sometimes I'll, I'll put one stick on a different surface, right? And when you do that, um, a little rhythmic melody pops out. <clears throat> and that is extremely useful. Um, so like I'm somebody that likes, you know, I, I grew up playing a lot with the Ted Reed syncopation book. Um, drum set players are going to know this book, uh, the, the new breed syncopation, the Gary Chester book. Um, these are, you know, just books that have melodies, rhythmic melodies, um, that are useful to work a bunch of different things. Um, the master stickings thing gives me that to a, to a degree, it's a little dense, but it gives me a rhythmic melody without having to have a book in front of me. So for instance, um, I'll do the same thing, just keep it kind of fast so we can get through it more. And I'll, rather than just play both sticks in the center, I will play them uh, with the right hand up in the dark matter oval. So it's not like this. And I'll take it a step further and I'll just, I'll not only play the hand in a different location, but I'll just accent the right hand and I won't accent the left hand. So you'll really get a sense of the rhythmic content. Two, ready, go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, tw